Welcome back to Tech Garage, presented by rockauto.com. Well, we made it to the heart of the electrical system on Garage Ed. We're talking about the battery. Now, what is a battery? Well, it's electrochemical pressure maker. We looked at it way back when we were talking about pressure and voltage. It makes pressure. Well, how does it do it? It does it with a chemical reaction. I could demonstrate it right here with a lemon. This is pretty cool because a lemon acts just like a battery. So you can see we have no volts. I got a galvanized nail and a copper penny stuck in it and we're producing some voltage there. How are we doing that? Well, it's actually a chemical reaction that goes on inside of it. You can actually see inside of this battery right here. If you look down here, you can see there's plates, there's grids, there's all kinds of things going on. They're just positive plates and negative plates sandwiched together, and what happens is they're insulated with this envelope so they can't touch. And through that, different sponge leads and chemicals that are going inside, it makes pressure, voltage. You put a bit of electrolyte, a little bit of water, sulfuric acid, and you get what's called electrolyte inside of your battery and it makes that chemical reaction. Now with that chemical reaction also comes some wear and corrosion. You can see these plates right here as I flip through it. These are some old plates and man it's just falling apart here because it only lasts so long. It can make that reaction and make that reaction and then it starts to flake. We'll look at some AGM technology on some batteries a little bit later that kind of prevent that. It does a lot better job. Now if we're going to test a battery that's hugely important. You can do a lot of this right out in the driveway yourself. The first thing you want to do is you want to do what's called OCV, open circuit voltage. Just take a meter and go across the battery. You want 12.6 or higher. Now what always staggers me, if you look at this graphic right here, this is pretty wild. A uh, fully charged battery puts out about 12.7 volts. What got me though is a 25% battery, charge battery is actually 12 volts. Now I thought a 12 volt battery was good. That thing's 25% discharged, but this one's in good shape. Now Rock Auto shipped over a whole array of parts that help you with servicing your battery. We'll start all the way over here. You actually have a handle right here. This handle helps you carry it. So when you're going from the left to right, you want to go ahead and use that when you're toting it. Why? Well, you wash your pants, you get all these little holes in there. Any part of that electrolyte or sulfuric acid gets on your clothes, it's going to destroy it. Hold down, super important part of the puzzle. And why is that? Well, that's because those plates, we want to make sure that battery is secure so we're not jiggling those plates. And you got the cleaning tools, you actually have the battery saver right here. If you pull it out, you keep the memory on the computer alive. And another cool tool they sent me, it's called a refractometer. This is pretty neat because what we did earlier is we just took it here, we opened it up, and when we opened it up, we put a little bit of electrolyte right there, closed it, looked through it. Now you can see the graphic yourself. I took a picture of it and it shows the specific gravity of the electrolyte that's directly related to the state of charge of the battery also ordered a tool now if you want to test your battery you can do this as well you go to a professional shop they're going to do the same thing I come over here and I just hook up the positive to the positive and the negative over here to the negative negative. and once I do that just follow the prompts it's pretty simple you can see them right there it says in vehicle test no we're going to do it out so I'm going to hit the plus it's sitting right here on the bench 12 volt battery yep enter correct surface charge 13.1 that's good we want 12.6 or higher to make the test so I'm gonna go ahead and hit plus next it says battery test we're gonna go ahead and hit it and it wants to know the CCA cold cranking amps that's stated on the battery you have cold cranking amps you have reserve capacity and you also have cold cranking amps at different temperatures that's gonna be determined by your manufacturer and what your car takes so make sure you find that I see the cold cranking amps on here I just come over and add it with a plus or minus to go ahead and start adding the cold cranking amps in there, I can go up or down. Ours is set on 800, that's what this is. So I just hit test, and it's testing the battery, just that easy. Voila, AMG battery, yeah, this one happens to be that, yes. There it is, good battery, it produced so many cold cranking amps, you're good to go. Now, with all these tools, we need to take a look over there with Tom and see what they got going on at rockauto.com. Well, nobody's happier than the gang here at Tech Garage. Tom, Rock Auto has batteries, yay! We do. We're really excited about that. It, the uh, secret was the absorb glass mat. They don't spill, so we can ship them by FedEx. So you, yeah, you just look under electrical and battery for your specific vehicle. You get the correct battery. Uh, not a, a absorb glass mat, AGM. They don't spill, and they, re, they withstand heat and cold, the extreme heat and cold winters and summers. So they, they can last twice as long as, as the old-fashioned batteries. The, the electrolytes in, in permanently embedded in this glass mat, so yeah, they, they can't leak. Yeah, that's the coolest thing. We saw them earlier. I mean, you got a whole um, selection of them. I mean, different manufacturers, I was shocked. There's a ton of them on there. Right, yeah, we even have uh, hybrid batteries. Awesome. <laughs>
<laughs> awesome. Yeah, I got a, I think I got a use for a hybrid battery. We'll talk about that a little bit later. <laughs> All right. I'll tell you what, I'm going to do a little more shopping on rockauto.com. Take a look at them hybrid batteries. You take a short break, but don't go far because we'll be back with more Tech Garage presented by rockauto.com.